This is Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works and I am your Sunday blogger Rosemary. Welcome. I am looking like a hot mess because I'm a hot mess. <laughs> Sorry guys. Let me get comfortable. I have been uh, working out and I thought oh, I didn't do a Proof Weight Loss Surgery work, so let me get this over with. The question is, did you lose fast at the beginning of your journey? And um, it is really, um, I think I answered this question uh, on my channel. I entitled it, uh, How I Eat After Seven Years, because a lot of people were asking. So this question is being asked a lot right now, which is wonderful. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and combine this with uh, the same thing that uh, I got asked um, again. How much weight did you lose before YouTube and how much since? Was there a stall or plateau in between? And uh, Wendy, I'm sorry, I'm just going to go ahead and do this video uh, all together. Proof weight loss surgery works and someone that asked the same, same kind of questions. Um, and the only reason I'm saying sorry, Wendy, is because Wendy, she handles this, this channel. She gives us these questions. But anyway, I'm sure she does not mind. Mwah, I love you, Wendy. Anyway, um, no, I lost very, 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 very slow at the beginning. Uh, I've explained this many times, but it's okay. I'm going to answer it again. When I first started my journey, um, Again, I was given a pamphlet. I was not given all the information that you guys are given now, which is amazing. Uh, I would cherish everything, all that information that you get, guys, in, in your books, your pamphlets, whatever you get from your doctor, I would cherish it. And I would go to those support groups because they're very ne ne it's a necessity in your uh, journey. Um, so at the beginning I noticed that I wasn't losing I thought it was like a miracle drug I thought really I did this surgery and I'm supposed to be losing every week and what's going on I'm not losing you know what's going on uh, the only thing my stomach would tolerate at the beginning was like um, sugar-free puddings I was eating a lot of uh, mashed potatoes I was eating uh, grits I was eating malta meal even though I wasn't eating very much of it I was eating it and it was causing me to stall my my weight gain my weight uh, kind of stayed at the same uh, when I did the Atkins I went down to a hundred and forty seven pounds and then I got up to 265 trying to make this as short as possible uh, the doctor you know said look the best thing for you to maintain your weight is gastric bypass so you know took the gastric bypass had the gastric bypass thought I was going to have a miracle happen and weight was just going to fall off me right it didn't happen that way to me now I know why I was adding too many carbs into my diet and it was causing me to stall and I would lose maybe a half a pound and uh, maybe two weeks it was crazy I was not exercising at all I never exercised with the with the Atkins and uh, so my weight was even slower. Uh, I really didn't start this game until I found YouTube. So I am blessed to be here. And I am so blessed to learn from all of you. Um, so I'm, like I said, I'm trying to make it really short. But uh, no, the question was, did I lose, uh, you know, fast? No, I did not. I lost slower than a turtle. Uh, Exit Melanie says she's... She's slower than a turtle. Well, I'm slower, slower than a turtle. <laughs> um, how much did I lose? Like I said, about a half a pound uh, every two weeks. I struggled and struggled and struggled. Now, I'm not going to say that I didn't f eventually lose some weight. I did lose about 50 pounds, and I stayed at about 185. I lost a little bit over, let's see, 60, 65. Maybe 85 pounds, 90 pounds altogether. I stayed about 180, 85 uh, for a long time. That was my plateau. I stayed there for almost ever. That was like my body did not want to lose it. And uh, I began to exercise. I began to do the things that I was hearing. Like, you know, eat out of a cup of food. I started 
again from the very beginning. I may, I forced myself, I can't say it was in, enjoyable, but I forced myself to eat one fourth of a cup three times a day with a very small snack like a cheese stick or a little bit of pudding in between just to see if my stomach would shrink and, 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 and I could start to lose the weight. And I was losing weight. Then I gradually went to a half a cup. And now I eat between a half a cup and a cup of food. In fact, I was just about, I just finished exercising. I did, uh, it's time for dinner. And I actually have my cup of food and I'm not sure if I'm gonna finish it. Like I said, if you've gone to Gastric Rose, you see that I eat out of this. And I'm having um, spinach with a little bit of uh, turkey meat in it. And uh, I make my spinach soup anyway. But it's hearty. It's not. It's thick. It's basically a, 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 a box of spinach, and I crush it up with my hand blender, and uh, then I add a sprinkle a little bit of turkey meat in it with some cheese. And uh, when I'm grinding it up with my hand blender, I add a little bit of um, uh, uh, mushroom soup, crema mushroom. Just in this one, I only added uh, about I think it was two tablespoons, and not even that because I kind of, you know, just put a little bit, you know. Uh, but anyway, I think, yeah, it was two tablespoons. But it's basically spinach is what it is. Because um, I, I don't want it to go down really quick. And I try and eat, uh, try and go really slow. I'm learning to eat slow again. It's like I, I push to get those rules back into my life. Um, it's like second nature to me now. But sometimes when you, you know, you like I was off and I went uh, to Las Vegas and was eating not very much food but I wasn't eating you know I wasn't on my schedule so I'm now I'm back on my schedule okay guys like I said I've tried to make this I've tried to make it as short as possible she's also asking was there a stall or plateau I, I've told you yeah I it, well there was and um, I hope I've helped I know that my journey is an unusual journey uh, in most cases um, but I'm here to tell you that you can do this you can start all over again. I did. And uh, I, I see myself shrinking. Uh, I'm still at 149, that scale. Darn that scale. <laughs> uh, but it's okay. Because um, I'm healthier, happier. And I, put, I make an effort to exercise every day. And I think that's the key to, you know, getting rid of those plateaus. Uh, my body wants to stay really at 149 I really don't consider it a plateau anymore for my body I'm in maintenance you know yeah Sally I said it I am in maintenance <laughs> it's hard to say because Mama Rose still wants to get to 130 and I think I'm still gonna get there but you know I, I, I still love to exercise that's key I still drink my water and I still measure my food out so I know that th that wasn't all of the questions it was only one question and I went overboard with it like always but um i love you guys and uh, i hope i could help i will see you here next sunday bye for now